Hi, this is Jonathan. How are you guys doing? In this video, you're going to feature this guitar from GNL. This is the Fallout in Shell Pink.
I never did tell anybody, but uh, pink happens to be one of my favorite colors. Um, the color pink makes me think of happy things like, you know, candy floss, ice cream. <laughs> and um, this is in shell pink. Pink, nevertheless. Um, it features a GNL P90 and a GNL Humbucker. Uh, this is the GNL AW4470B, right? Um, interesting humbucker, right? And um, it features the saddle lock bridge, which I spoken about uh, when I was reviewing, if I'm not mistaken, the uh, ASAT Plus or the ASAT Special. This bridge uh, is kind of like um, drilled into the whole body, so there are like screws that has been driven into it to increase the stain. It has a saddle lock, meaning that you can actually lock it with a you know, Allen key and the saddles won't move, thereby increasing sustain too. Features a volume and a tone knob, which also features uh, a push-pull for the coil split of the humbucker, the bridge humbucker. Has a three-way selector, uh, three-way pickup selector. Um, nice pearl, uh, Pick guard, yeah. Now the neck of this guitar is really interesting. This is a slim C profile, um, much slimmer than the GNL Comanche or the GNL uh, Blues Boys that I own. In fact, it's slimmer than most of the GNL guitars that I played. Um, and it features also a 12-inch fret radius. So this this neck is built for speed, coupled with the medium jumbo frets. You know, it's it's really nice, really easy, really easy uh, neck and. Uh, I'll tell you later. Right. And it features a bone nut, right? And uh, the normal GNL tuners. It has a pink headstock, right? Uh, same color as the body. It's pretty cool. This is a, a, a rock maple with a satin finish, right? It's, there's no glass in it, there's no finish to it. Um, and that's bad, right? Body is made of base wood, right? Um, so this is American base wood. Of all the guitars that I played, this guitar is one of the best sustained ever, you know. And I can get away with little musical nuances um, when I'm when I'm playing like little, you know, little feels, little thrills. I can get away with things that I would not normally attempt. And coupled with the fact, uh, and coupled with the fact that you know it has a, a 12 inch fret radius, a slim C profile with the mirror jumbo frets, and the satin finish, uh, it makes playing a breeze, you know. In, 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 whether it's chords or rail lines, you know, it's so easy to play. This guitar is so easy to play. And it's not heavy, you know. Uh, I'll put out the weight. And of course it comes with other colors, you know. This pink is not the only color. I'm sure there are other colors in this uh, Fallout range. And it also comes with uh, tremolo arm variation with the dual fulcrum, the GNL dual fulcrum. And that would be great for, for guitarists who, like me, who likes to use the tremolo arm. Um, yeah. So tell me what do you think? Do you have a fallout? And do you like it? You know, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, give me a thumbs up and uh, subscribe to this channel. You know, and I'll I'll see you again. I'll see you again real soon uh, with another video of another Gino guitar that I have right now. So until the next video, you guys take care. Ciao.